What's going on everyone? It's your boy coming back at you again here with another little vlog. I hope you guys had a fantastic weekend. If you're new to the channel, I hope I get to earn your subscription today. For those OG subscribers, welcome back. It's a little bit of a different vlog today. We're going off-roading. I wanted to uh, show you some upgrades that I did to my truck over the weekend and I hope you guys like it. Now this hill should start to go down. It should creep over to uh, a different fire road here soon. It is gonna be a little bit different. Like I said, um, in Oregon, in the middle of June, it is still raining. So uh, I'm really sorry. I, I always wanna post motor vlogs for you guys, but unfortunately it does look like I'm gonna have to change direction a little bit. Uh, and post some off-road videos in the truck or some gun videos or some build videos You know just something a little bit different. So let me go ahead and find a spot here real quick and uh, we'll get right to it All right now we're getting into some pretty thick stuff here All right should drop yep just dropped early stage of crawl control or A-track working for me. All right, so here we go. This is when we start coming down. Check out that view. The downhill descent working. I still have, this is a pretty steep hill, so I've got my foot right over the brake just in case. But it seems like she's doing it. Wow. This is the steepest hill I've ever done, the downhill descent, and it's, uh, she's working. I have not touched the brakes once. Big log right here, right over it, no problem. Look at the view, though. Holy smokes. So eerie feeling, you know? All right, you guys, we're back. I just wanted to find a nice little spot to uh, film this for you guys real quick. And do... It is raining, so I do want to make this somewhat quick. Of course, like I did mention in Oregon, it is still raining in the middle of June. As you can see, it is raining. So I just wanted to uh, talk to you guys a little bit about the 4Runner TRD Pro Edition. I really, really like that truck, and I love the 4Runner platform, but I'm not going to spend the money for a TRD Pro. Those trucks are like 50, 60 grand. I really want one, but you know what? I'm just... <laughs> That just blows my mind for that price for one of those. So I decided I want to make my own. So as you can see, these were just put on. These are TRD Pro wheels wrapped in some BFGs. Um, what makes this truck a little bit unique is that it actually has TRD Pro suspension all the way around it. Now, believe it or not, the TRD Pro suspension bolts right up to this truck. So, I tried to make it as clean as possible, but I couldn't. <laughs> but, you gotta believe me. This is TRD Pro suspension wheels all the way around this truck. You can see the TRD right there, maybe, if I zoom in. TRD right there. You know, and these have the big reservoirs on it big bilstein reservoirs all the way around it um and you know believe it or not this actually gave it about a three inch lift and then you put these tires on it it really completes the package and i don't i just i just don't understand why you wouldn't um go this route with the forerunner now I can understand if you want Tacoma or whatever, something a little bit smaller, I get it. The Tundra, because you want a truck, I get that. But the 4Runner, this has got everything. It's got leather seats, heated seats, AC, sunroofs, rear window that comes down, and most importantly, this is one of the major reasons why I wanted this platform, the fourth gen, Forerunner. It's got the V8. It still has the early crawl control system on it. And right now it is doing that all by itself. 
I don't know if you guys can hear the ABS working or not, but I've got four low, downhill descent, traction control, all systems doing its thing. I am not touching the brakes at all right now. And this is a pretty dang steep hill. Of course, it doesn't show that at all, but there you go. Feet are not anywhere near the pedals. Just letting the truck do its thing. It does the job. It's never ever left me stranded. And now that it's got the suspension of a TRD Pro, <laughs> I mean, it's literally as if I have like the only fourth gen TRD Pro edition 4Runner, <laughs> you know? And I find it kind of cool. I mean, it might be a little cheesy. All Toyota, Toyota wheels, Toyota suspension, Toyota shocks, Toyota everything. Maybe I'm just geeking out a little bit. It's really interesting to me, like I said, is this is all fifth gen TRD Pro 4Runner stuff on a fourth gen 4Runner. And it bolted right on. Everything. Control arms, upper, lower control arms, the shocks, the piggyback reservoirs. Like I said, the TRD Pro stuff has reservoirs. And that's what that is. And that's the actual shock there. But this bolted right on to the frame so call me captain obvious or whatever but these have got to share the same frame but anyway you guys that's it for today it's just a little quick little video um i just wanted to update you guys on everything where the channel's going um like i said it is pouring rain out here in oregon so it kind of sucks, but I'm going to have to adjust the channel just a little bit between the motor vlogs and off-road life and forerunner life and project rebuilds and um, wrecked motorcycles, wrecked car rebuilds, guns, shooting, this and that. We're going to have to change some things up because this, I can't do anything with this weather when it comes to uh, motorcycles and the DRZ. So unfortunately, that's just what's going to have to happen. So I hope you guys uh, will still like and enjoy the videos and the content. Um, I will catch you guys on the next video. Hopefully it'll be tomorrow. Alrighty guys, see you on the next one.